Sick of copyright strikes on your YouTube videos? Forget it. Music A is the game changer now. This revolutionary tool lets you to generate a captivating music for your YouTube content or any kind of videos. You just plug in your own music and then have fun. Forget about all this generic stock music and copyright infringements. No copyrights and it's all yours. Yes. So let's get into this Google Music FX and you can see how you can create your own music and you can have fun. Okay, let's get into the Google FX. So on the prop, you can see it says labs.google FX tool music FX. So that's the link you can use it to get into the labs.google music FX. You can also find that link in the description. You can click on it and you can get in here. So on the interface, you can see on the left side, you have the prompt and on the right side, you can get the output. So you can see there on the music, it says zero to zero 30. So it will generate an output for 30 seconds and it will give you uh, two set of music options for whatever the prompt you are picking it up here. To get into the music effects, they don't have to be a sound engineer or a music director or know the music composition. So you can compose your own music for whatever the genre you want. Either it's a romantic or pop or, or you want it to go for a rock, any kind of genre you create for your own mood with the music effects. So let's get into it, what to do. So on your left side, like I said, this is the prompt and you don't even have to be a skilled like how to give a prompt there. So you can go with a very minimum basic. Um, you can see here they give an example, industrial techno sound, repetitive hypnotic rhythm. So I want to use that one. I'll go with my own uh, thing. Let's say I'm going to be like a very beginner. I don't even know what is music, what is sound, what is instrument, nothing. But I wanted to generate something like a, a romantic music. So I'll say romantic with using a violin instrument. That's all. I'm not going to put anything there. I'm going to keep it very simple and let's see what the output is. So it's cool, right? And it also giving you one more output. Let's listen to that. Perfect. So with the very simple prompt, you get a very decent music, right? It's not that much great, I would say, but still with a very basic prompt, you are getting a very simple romantic love music as a background. So let's say you want to present a YouTube content with talking about some kind of a romantic thing or a cinematic thing. This is more sufficient. This is like a copyright free. You can just download this and you can use it in your YouTube content. Nobody will give a strike on your YouTube content with using this music. You can just simply click on download here. So, and here you can see the settings. Here they gave a track length like 30 seconds, 50 seconds and 70 seconds. So you can go for a 70 seconds and then you can keep that in a loop. You can see here looping. So the looping, what it does is it stitches the beginning and end of your track to make your music endless, which means like 30 seconds length, it have a starting and end points to be like a connecting like a loop cycle so if you get that you put it in your youtube timeline anywhere and you can just copy paste multiple things and then it's just done so you'll have a continuous loop there won't be anything like a immediate stop or start in between the 30 seconds or the 670 seconds of uh, music so that is really good so let's deep dive into see like how professionally you can get your musics so what you can do is in, as you know, in chat GPT or any kind of chatbot, go and generate whatever the detailed music prompt you want, like a professional music prompt. Then you can just feed that here. So you will get a more uh, beautiful song or more professional songs by using all the different instruments there. So let's see, let's do one uh, thing like that. So I have some of the prompt here. So I'm going to pick this hard rock. So give start over and paste the professional prompt. I'm saying here, compose a piece that is four minutes long. It's not going to generate four minutes long. So let's make this as, so I'm going to, let's do that for 70 seconds, which is possible here. And then I'm going to say one minute inch, one minute long with a tempo of 140 BPM in a hard rock style. 
use it to start electric guitar, bass, pounding drum sets and all that. And it should be aggressive because it's a hard rock and powerful. It should be inspired by. So I'm giving some of the existing songs for the inspiration so that you can just use that track and then you can make more realistic rather than AI based kind of thing. This is my prompt. I'm going to generate uh, an audio for that. It parses all the prompt. <laughs> This is really awesome. If I wanted to go for such kind of a music, I have to go and search in so many YouTube channels like royalty free music or no copyright music. And when I get that, I need to put their credits. So I need to go and search for so many places to get a very good music with no copyrights. But now I don't have to do any kind of such research and chasing behind the copyright free music. I create my own. Whatever the mood I want, whatever the music style I want, I can generate it by myself by using this music effects. This is really cool, I would say. Let's move somewhere in middle and scene. It's... So it's not like repeating the same thing. For the whole 1, 20, 1 minute 20 seconds, the variations, everything is unique and if you see, they, we mentioned the tempo as 140 BPM. So it main, it maintains the tempo and it gives you uh, music for 1 minute 20 seconds with a more unique track. So this is really cool. To be honest, I already started using this music effects for my YouTube content. I generate my own music and I'm just putting that on my YouTube content. Like if you see my previous video, I use this Google music effects and created my own audios. And I'm just putting in my YouTube content. So now I'm not going for any copyright free music because I have my own tools to create my music now. This is one kind of a simple prompt. Let's go for a catchy jingle. Let's see this. I'm really more excited to see all these prompts, what kind of music it's generating. So let's see this. Nice. This is quite different genre, like it's a catchy, using bell whistles and cheerful voices. It should be a quickly memorable track of I'm loving it. So I'm just getting into a random chatbot. So I'm using the Mistral AI here. So I'm going here and I'm just saying, create a simple music prom with a 500 character for the music from Mexican Spanish style, like a pop music using techno electronic musical instruments. So it's just a basic thing. I'm not Whatever it comes in my mind, I'm just putting there. Now let's see what kind of problem it's coming up with. So I'm gonna just copy paste this to my music FX and let's see what the output is. This is so good. I really love this one. So now when you think something and you wanted to create a music for that, you can go and do that using this Google Music FX. So get into this Music FX, whatever it's have in your mind, feed that into your prop and get the music and listen to it. If you wanted to create a content, use that music. If you wanted to hear for fun, just hear and have fun. So this one, it's absolutely free now. Like I said earlier, I don't know when they were going to put a price on it, but as of now, it's completely free. So make use of it and generate as much as you can. Get all the musics with a different moods, different genre, and then save it and use it for your all YouTube contents or any other social media content. Use your musics, use your mood, use your music and have fun. And stop worrying about the copyright issues anymore. No more music copyright issues. Your idea, your music, have fun with the music effects.